guys what's up today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your iPad um, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd generation iPhone 4 and 3GS on version 5.0 um, betas 5 and 6 now what you're going to need to do first is download the 5 uh, the 5.0 beta 6 version of your uh, device's software and you need this from the dev center developers can only do this jailbreak because they're the only ones that can get it now once you have that, you're also going to need to download Snowbreeze, which will be um, a post uh, to download a download in our post with the link in the description. Now, once you have those two, you can start by booting up Snowbreeze and follow along how we do. For this demonstration, we'll just be showing you pictures of what's happening, and you should be fairly familiar with Snowbreeze if you're jailbreaking as a developer. So we'll just be quickly going over it. So what you're going to do first is open the Snowbreeze application that you downloaded, then just hit continue, and then hit the blue arrow, and you'll get to this next page. Now drag the IPSW that you've gotten from online into the where it says drag your IPSW, and it'll start to jailbreak. Once it's identified, it will say it's found, and you can continue. Now tap expert mode and hit the blue um, arrow. Once you do that, hit build IPSW and continue hitting the blue arrow again. Now this step could take up to 15 minutes, so it takes a while, just come back later. And once you do that, it will be done. Now what you're going to need to do is follow the steps in the next few pages. And basically it's turning your device into DFE mode. Once you do, you'll get to um, this right here. You'll get this pop-up on Snowbreeze. Basically what happens is now you're going to hold shift on the keyboard, hit the restore button, and you're going to find snowbreeze underscore iPod touch or whatever your device is underscore f f um, f the version you're on 5.0 beta 1. Now this will be in the same place your snowbreeze is, so you're just going to hit open and do that right now. Now when you hit restore, it will restore. Once you're restored, you'll be restored to software that is already jailbroken so you have Cydia and once you hit this you're done and you can just hit that now uh, side note this is tethered so what you're going to need to do is you'll find a folder called iBooty on your desktop or wherever you ran Red or Snowbreeze and what you're going to need to do is open this then open iBooty.exe select your device and hit start follow the instructions every time your device is turned off to turn it back on now, if you don't want to have to do that, you can always un-jailbreak, that's fine, or wait for a better jailbreak. Thanks for watching this video, hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.